352 Walls Gainesville Art Initiative kicked off its second season in October. The project began in 2015, creating 23 murals and 7 GRU electrical boxes. With added improvements and new aspects, project leaders hope the initiative will be even better in its second season. Uh, the, the project has more structure. Uh, we have created a curatorial committee made up of four curators and uh, one uh, art producer, myself, and Ross Edling, who is the manager of cultural affairs for the city of Gainesville. And so we have formed a collaboration with the University of Florida uh, School of Art and Art History to add this educational component which we feel is very, very important. The students are eager to know and learn about and practice urban street art. Urban street art meaning the same thing. And so we've started, it's, it's been a slow start. We've decided that from now on, uh, uh, the, the visiting muralists um, must get involved with the community and the student body, uh, whether it's in the form of a lecture, a workshop, or a masterclass. Um, they will give back to the community and they will teach and they will share their experiences and their backgrounds and their techniques. 352 Walls has an innovative collaboration with the University of Florida School of Art and Art History. The goal is to provide students with new opportunities and to connect students with downtown Gainesville. In collaboration with the University of Florida, we're hoping that it bridges the university with the city. Um, there is a need for uh, a program of urban art and street art at the University of Florida School of Art. We are hoping that um, this is the uh, sort of a prototype and we move forward with, and the university moves forward with creating a, a program for urban art and street art in the near future as a result of these collaborations. Because we saw that a lot of really fantastic artists were coming to town and making murals and I was very interested in having my students interact with those artists and learn from them. It seemed like there was an opportunity there for teaching and learning that I wanted to get my hands on. So I started working with the city and the 352 Murals Project to see how we could bring campus and town together on this event. So this year we have three different workshops and artists are teaching mural making skills to the public and that public includes UF students, Santa Fe College students and community members. We've had sign painters from Tallahassee, all kinds of local artists participate in this and it's a really unique opportunity. Um, there aren't any, there isn't a parallel program anywhere, so this is very unique and there's a lot of interest in um, around world about how to do what it is that we're doing and it's very much a learning process and there's always you know bumps and things to learn from which is also what makes it kind of exciting so I think we're still flying by the seat of our pants which is how the 352 murals project started last year but we're starting to get a lot more people involved and that's making it more exciting and, and just a really great opportunity for UF. So I think it's bringing like more of an art community here in Gainesville which is really cool and I think that like where I'm from, Miami, there's this huge Wynwood. I feel like this is growing so much more now. Since we have artists now, we're able to like connect with the artists and see like real life artists doing these huge things. And then we have this wall we can experiment on and we have like experience for the future.